to introduce yourself. Uh, thank you, and first and foremost, uh, that we appreciate the chairman, uh, Martina Butcher, the senior representative of SPLM, SPLIO, to Citizen VM. Uh, I also recognize the presence of the diplomatic corps, other senior dignitaries, as well as the press who are here today. So thank you so much for coming to attend our opening session. Indeed, we shall have a closed session, which we shall discuss substantial issues. But uh, it's grateful that all of you are present here today. Uh, uh, Chair, I, I would like to also kind of understand a little bit, uh, maybe a few points that maybe it was a slip of the tongue about the police commission of Mayom, which, is, which I am not clear what it is. But indeed, there's a continuous insecurity going on in Unity State, which is very concerning to all of us. So these issues have to be quickly contained and brought to attention. The city is some workshop in Rome. It was an important milestone in the peace process, which we had agreed on over a year ago. And I'm very grateful that the SOMA team uh, called it SOMA Group, have responded positively, attended a training, and that's not the first training, that was the second training after the training in Nairobi there the year before, so that they can become part of the city some structures. These structures are important so that we build the milestones for having peace in South Sudan. So these uh, important milestones that we, we have to, to do, but also important, Chair, we have to continue to communicate with the other structures the JMCC and JDB, regards to of what are they doing in regards to the monitoring and containment of the permanent ceasefire. Uh, my understanding is there is a, quite a bit of activity that has been commissioned since April, and maybe it will be realized very soon, so it will be good also we'll all I thought you would have reported this in your statements, but I did not hear about it. What kind of services are there or what services are going to be going into the controlment areas based on what is happening uh, with what the provisions agreed on to in this uh, session? The situation in Warab, not only Warab, by the way, it's Paragazel as a whole. Maybe even South Sudan as a whole is very alarming. There is a lot of intercommunal violence. I don't know whether these are part of the ceasefire issues, or I would love to also find out if these ceasefire issues or these are not ceasefire issues, because intercommunal violence in Eastern Equatoria is not between the parties. Some of it is between in communities, some of it is between maybe the forces and the communities. Are these part of ceasefire issues or are these not part of ceasefire issues? So we need to come to understanding of that. But more importantly, we have talked about restructuring citizens for a long time. Chair, it's important we go back and look at have we restructured citizen? Is citizen able to my will to actually deliver on its mandate? These are critical points that I think today as we leave, we should have a serious discussion on it because our partner, the United States of America, has left us. 
we are now on our own. What do we do? How do we move forward? But most important, Chairman, I want to bring to your attention that the other security mechanisms are very important. I'm very grateful that representative of JTSC is here. But it's not only JTSC that's a security mechanism, but should be reporting and be informed at this meeting. You have the Joint Defense Board. You have the Joint uh, the JMCC. You also have the SDSR. But very special now, we have issues on the river Nile. We also need to have to request the command of the river Rhine to tell us what's happening on the Nile. Um, I don't know if you have monetary mechanism on the river Nile. If it's not existing, we also should have to understand how do we monitor activities on the river Rhine if this is impeding the peace process, if it's impeding activities uh, of the monitoring. So I would like to leave that. Uh, we shall have to discuss these issues in depth, which are very important to us. So if the structures of CDSAM doesn't accommodate that, we should also discuss it. Thank you. Thank you, General. Thank <laughs> you.